All eyes on Gabriel Jesus. In a rich vein of form, a number one on the scoring charts. Can he do it again today, live on EA TV? Always a terrific venue to watch a football match. I'm talking about the Emirates Stadium here in North London. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Arsenal versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Kai Havertz starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the main forward is Gabriel Jesus. Oh, that was a chance to give them an early advantage. Well, they should be off to a flyer here. And that was a poor effort. He must hit the target. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. Declan Rice went in strongly to win the ball. But as we glance at the table, it really is shaping up to be a captivating season, highly competitive, especially at the summit. Well, what a great title race this looks like being. Yes, there's a long way to go, but it's difficult to split these teams at the moment. Let's hope I'm right. Just the challenge that was required. Arsenal had too much for their opponents in the win against Brentford. How do you think this one will go, Stuart? Well, that was one of their best attacking displays I've seen this season. Every time they went forward, they looked like scoring. Today, I think we'll see them dominate the play, create good chances and win the game. Oh, hang on, Stuart, it's a chance. Well, it's a wild attempt. He needed something better. Offside, however. Well, you're right. He didn't know it was going to be offside, and that was a shocking miss. Oh, he's given the ball away. He has been one of the leading lights in the competition so far, Gabriel Jesus. Well, as you can see, his form in front of goal has been superb. He just has that knack of finding space in the box. And then, of course, he's a brilliant finisher. I'm sure he'll show us that again today. And Kai Havertz. Very quick thinking there. Mateus Cunha. It's with Erdogan. Determined defending. Still level here, but the pressure escalating to give them the advantage. And cleared off the line. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Now will the cross work out for them? Oh, super header, but the goalkeeper was up to the task. Well, here it is again, and quite clearly it didn't cross the line. Mind you, it was very close. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. Oh, that's a goal at the wrong end. Well, it's every defender's nightmare. An own goal here. Well, as the replay shows us, that will be classed as an own goal. He's a bit unlucky there. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Well, the situation has changed in the Chelsea game. There's been a goal there. Alex Scott. 
it's a goal for Brighton. They're back level. It's 1-0 with 28 minutes on the clock. Many thanks, Alex. Good-looking sequence. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. There's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Cunha. Can they keep it out? And a time for cool heads. Well, Wolves can't do much more than that to draw level. That was a brilliant save by the goalkeeper. What well, a shocking pass, really. Attacking possibilities for Wolves here. And he's in. Oh, no. It's gone a begging. Well, they can't miss opportunities like that. What a chance to equalise. And defending as a unit. Mateus Cunha. Real chance. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. An encouraging Arsenal move. Ben White. Magnificent defending. Oh, that's a really good run. Can he take advantage? Oh, a goal for Arsenal. It's theirs to lose now. Well, as you can see, Havertz does so well to create the chance with this dribble and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Wang Hee Chan. And he read it well, intercepting it. There will be one minute added on at the end. A chance to whip it in. Might it be Gabriel Jesus? A smart stop here. So the corner played into the box. He can't hold on to it. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Well, that's going to be all for the first half here at the home of Arsenal. Well, he's been a long way from his best up front, Stuart. Well, Derek, he's usually so clever around. And the ball is rolling again. Wolves left with a mountain to climb here in the second half. Can they respond? And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Accurate ball in towards the near post. Well, it didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done. Nuri. Arsenal have given it away. Don't forget we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Arsenal versus Luton Town. And what a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. Bukayo Saka. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Very quick thinking there. Well, being pressed here. Martinelli. Chances on. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Well, plenty of power, but just too much height on it. 
Well, Arsenal are looking really good today. Just look how many chances they've created. And I sense there's still more to come here. Has the strength to hang on to it. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Now, options are plenty. But timely defending when it mattered. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Well, they're almost extending an invitation to have them come at them. Martinelli. A oh, big opportunity! And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. Substitution time it is here. And over it comes. Well, it's a moment he would like to have back, if possible. Well, delighted to say, more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Wolves facing Burnley. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. Gabriel Jesus. Martinelli. Throw in here for Arsenal. And possession lost, intercepted. Now the quick counter attack could be on. Determined defending. Right, I'm going to send it over to Alex Scott because I believe, Alex, a goal at the vitality. It's a goal for Bournemouth. They're back in this Oh, now. hang on, Alex. Big chance here. It's gone in. And, well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, but the finish is far too easy. He doesn't even have to jump. How has he afforded that much space? It's a tidy header, but really poor defending. Well, as you'll have noticed, we had to cut Alex a bit short just then. To clarify, Bournemouth have found the net in that match, and it's level now at one goal apiece. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And teammates around him. Oh, great attacking play. Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Jorginho. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Real chance. And a goal! Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place, but give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. So the game continues, and Arsenal cantering to victory now. Mateus Cunha. Arsenal have given it away. Ten minutes to go. Well, news coming through that the referee has pointed to the spot in one of the other matches. With the details, here's Alex. Yes, it was Chelsea that were awarded the penalty and the goalkeeper has pulled off a worldie of a save with this one. The scoreline remains 3-1 with 80 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. And 
he's made headway. Can they put it away? Well, no damage done. Pedro Neto. Well, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? Well, didn't go to plan in the end. And the referee blows for a foul. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Did well to clear it away. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Looking for a teammate. Well, he passed the power test. Shame about the accuracy. Bukayo Saka. The fans are shouting, shoot! And making sure there was no danger in the end. Well, that's as good a challenge as you're likely to see. And so that is that. The referee blows for full time. A victory for Arsenal. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent. Full of energy and pace. And the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. Well, one thing we often say about Kai Havertz is that he's so very hard to silence. And that was the case in this game. Sum up his contribution for us. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good decision.